on this episode of Lapeef Let's Talk. Look, look, don't try to cap on me. Look, like this. Logic is ashamed of his body count. You know what I'm saying? As a man, I'm ashamed. Is that low? Military. No, it's probably like it, in the You know what's digits. crazy, Logic? It's a lot is it low. over 100? You asking too many questions, but I said I'm telling you. Yeah, it was only one question. No, but I'm just saying I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say that. But I'm telling you I'm ashamed now. You know what I'm saying? Cause I, I'm still. You know what I'm saying? You you like I say a man talk different ways that we can find happiness too. So uh, like I said, as a man, I'll be the one that say I'm ashamed of that. And now I tell young jits not to be slanging iron like that across the. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you, you, was, you was slinging that thing, Mr. Logic? Slinging hey, that thing? Hey. Did you, did you it around? Slut monkey? I don't even think that's the question. I think we are all aware. That not fulfilling that role, just not as a mother, but a role as a wife, then they still got some soul searching to do, and they not truly, they not truly happy. Because I can tell you, I'm not truly happy. I'm not fulfilling my job as a man. I, don't I agree. Believe, I agree. I don't believe that there's honestly, in in my opinion, and it's just again, and shout out to Logic, bro. Listen, don't ever be a don't ever slow down your props and flaws, flaws, bro. You earned it. You put in the work. We spend too much time celebrating all of the negative and highlighting all of the stuff that people do on the negative space. And so when it get time to acknowledge stuff that people did in the positive space, we're not going to hold that back either. So floss, I'm supportive of that. Floss, uh, right, right. I go to my IG. Y'all see my, my, my ribbons is up to my, my chin. My neck. Yeah. Yeah. No, and, we service, that, man. and we celebrate that. That's dope. Mm -hmm. But honestly, I don't think, I don't believe that there is a woman in the world that's happier than my chick. I don't think that there's a woman in the world that is happier than my chick. And if you telling me these city girls is out here winning, I don't believe it. I, I don't know who it. said that, but um, <laughs> I don't know who said that, but nobody here. Everybody's that. like respectful of what they want in life. That. I'm I think using everybody's an example to illustrate that women that have a husband that can truly focus on the things as meaningful to them ex and instead of substituting it with all of this school and all of this debt and all of this other type of stuff that actually do not bring any kind of happiness or fulfillment. It does not translate in the same way of a woman that's fulfilling her purpose. And I think that Courtney often emphasized exactly what she feels like her a woman's purpose is. And I think that women that fulfill that purpose, they oft, often at times result, they get better results and they're happier. Yeah, so I was gonna go ahead. Hold go on, ahead. hold on. I haven't answered the question. Um, and I agree with logic and I agree with Anton on this one. Um, I think that there's my mom used to tell me, and it's not the correct definition, but I understood it. She said happiness is a fleeting emotion where you can be happy, you can be sad, it's fleeting. But if you have true joy in your soul, uh, that's the thing that's consistent. That's the thing uh, that fulfillment is for. So can someone be happy if they're not married or leaving out of a marriage and thinking that the grass is green on the other side? Yes, they can have happy moments. Uh, like Mr. Lodge said, you know, I can travel. I can, you know, have some days that I'm out with the homies and having a good time. But when Valentine's Day on Monday is coming up, on those Christmas when you know, everybody wearing them PJs, <laughs> you know, on those times where you're sick and you're there by yourself and no one's there to coddle you or hold you, those are the real true moments that I think single people, or unmarried people realize, yes, I need somebody here with me. When I need to get something on top of the shelf and I can't reach it, I wish I had that tall, sexy man, you know, <laughs> come and get my stuff. So there's Meow. always going to, hey. So there's happy moments, absolutely. But true fulfillment, again, I always preach this. It comes when you're fulfilling what you were created to do. My body was created to be a wife because it's created for a man. My body is created to be a mother. So that if I'm not, if I'm not in the role of what God made me to be, I'm out of order. And that it itself will, will cause chaos. 
Facts. You are created. Your fulfillment comes with what you're created to be. And that's a wife, husband, m- mommy, daddy. And the thing, the biggest thing about that is you got to be selfless. You can't be selfish and have that mentality. And a lot. And the problem with us is we learn is when we get to that point that society tell us we need to get to. Mm-hmm. We, we have all these goals we set. We say, hey, we get these degrees. We go here. We, we, we bust our ass and we sit here and we try to achieve happiness through success. But ideally, our true happiness comes from each other. A man and a woman, a man or, you know what I'm saying, whatever your preference, you know what I'm saying. But that would bring us true happiness. So we got to deal with that. Yeah. Hey, what is that whatever your pre- preference part? What, what was that part? Hey, you know, we got to be, uh, I work for if the If they girl. like men or women. I don't have to be like that. But you you know. If you like. If you like <laughs> look, hey, I'm trying not to turn up. So look, look, let me be. If you like, I like uh, this logic better. <laughs> I mean, you know, if you like getting touched by what? y'all, be weak. I said I like, Stand up. I said I like this Stand logic up. better. The one that's if, doing if better. Like... <laughs> Let's just <Yeah>. not. <laughs> nope. Just nope. Not. Uh, I can't so, about here. No. I'm not saying nothing is wrong with it. I'm right. Nope. That, you know, like dabbling in the other side a little bit, you know? Let's just oh. not do it. Let's oh, just say we did. Like don't we say we did. Dabble, we homosexual. They're called homosexual and we got heterosexual, whatever you like. To each its own. I don't have any problem with it. I'm just saying, like, be you. That's all I'm saying. Like, don't be afraid to say it. Just say what you say. And, you know. Look, 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 look. Don't try to cap on me. Look, like this. Logic <laughs> is ashamed of his body count. You know what I'm saying? As a man, I'm ashamed. <laughs> is you that low? In the no. no, it's probably is like it, in the But you know what's digits. crazy, Logic? It's a is it over 100? You asking too many questions, but I said, I'm telling yeah, you. It was only one question. No, but I'm just saying I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say that, but I'm telling you I'm ashamed now. You know what I'm saying? Cause I, I'm still, you know what I'm saying? You you like I say a man talk different ways that we can find happiness too. So uh, like I said, as a man, I'll be the one that say I'm ashamed of that. And now I tell young jits not to be slanging iron like that across the you know what I'm saying. Oh, you, you, was, you was slinging a thing, Mr. Logic? Slinging a thing? Hey. You, you, you just gonna slap monkey? I don't even think that's the question. I think we are all aware. 